how to make a hospital gown out of trash bags. First, you need a large, flat, clean surface. Wipe your surface down before you begin because these will be used in a hospital. Ta-da! Second, you need your supplies. These trash bags are from Home Depot. They're 55 gallon bags that are 1.7 millimeters thick. Grab two bags, an iron, some paper, scissors, and a yardstick. Make sure all of these are sanitized well. For the paper, just make sure it's clean. Now that you have everything, you're gonna make your cuts. It's more manageable to keep the bag folded for this part. Measure 50 inches in length of the bag from the bottom and cut a line straight down. Save your end piece for later. Flatten out the bag. On the bottom side of the bag, cut out a semi-oval 10 inches in length and 1 inch wide. This will be the neck of the gown. Lastly, cut out 15 inch slits from the neck side of the piece on both sides. Now grab your second bag. This will make up our sleeves. Cut the bottom of the bag off because we want to have both sides of the sleeves open. From where you just cut the bottom from, measure 25 inches in length and cut a line straight down. This helps if you use a sharpie to draw a line. Save the half of the bag you just cut off for later. You can make another two sleeves with it. Measure down 10 inches of one end of one side and 15 inches on the other end on the same side. From these two markings, you can draw a line down to mark where you'll cut with a sharpie. Do the same on the other side of this piece, but flip the end so it's easier to cut. Now you can cut. You can cut a cardboard template for the sleeves to make your life easier. Now it's ironing time. Get a sleeve and lay it down sideways. Put some paper in the middle and fold one side over, creating a one inch overlap in the process. The paper in the middle prevents the layers from melting together when you iron it. Cover the overlap with paper and go over it with an iron until it's sealed. It usually takes about three or four glides to make a strong seal. Test the seal by slightly pulling on it to make sure it's strong. Repeat this process for both sleeves. Now place your sleeves on each side of the middle piece. The seal that you ironed should face downwards. Put a piece of paper in the middle like before. Put the sleeve inside. Again, make an overlap of one inch. Now go over the overlap with an iron. Be careful not to let the iron touch the plastic without the plastic being covered by a piece of paper. This will burn through the plastic. You'll need to do this on both sides. Turn the bag over to iron the other side. Now that your sleeves are adjusted, cut thumb holes in the sleeves 3 inches from the end. Now, cut down the middle of one side of the gown. This is marked by the center fold of the bag. This will be the back side of the gown. Take that end piece from earlier and cut out two one inch strips. Cut the ends of them so it becomes four strips. Iron the strips onto the side that is cut in half, two on the neck and two at the waist. For reference, the waist is around 18 inches down from the neck. The part that is ironed should be around one square inch. Now quality control. Please don't put it on because that will contaminate it. Just jump with it. Lean with it. Rock with it. If it doesn't break, you're done! Thank you for helping our local health heroes.